N-N-E. This is Nano, um, a good couple good friends of mine. In fact, John and Jay uh, are two of the big investors in this. Um, and what is this? These are micro reactors, Pete. So Pete and I talked at the top of the show about how energy had a fabulous week, a fabulous quarter. Well, Nano, NNE, is a new stock on the scene, micro nuclear reactors. So forget about the gigantic ones that take decades to build and that uh, are you know really difficult to permit it and all the rest. These guys are in that space, but with a lot less hassle. And that's why that stock was up, what, 49% last week, Pete. And it's moving higher again today. It's up 33% today. Not so bad. No. Um, it Lightbridge, LTBR, up 40% last week. Enovix, ENVX, up 28%. Uh, Skeena Resources, SKE, up 18% last week. There's a lot going on in this space. And it does center on what Pete said with Maria Bartiromo hmm. just a week and a half, two weeks ago now, when he said, Maria, if you want to bet on AI, you got to bet on energy because it's really thirsty for energy, right, Pete? It's exactly right. It is thirsty for energy. That That's going to take a lot. And, and the only way that you can do it and do it at a consistent level is nuclear, quite frankly. And so yep. whether it's the smaller names like you're just talking about, nuclear energy, I mean, nano has absolutely been exploding, as you said. A lot of these various names have been moving to the upside in a big way. And you still can look at the old school names. And I say old school because the CCJs of the world, Cameco and some of these other names, they're big, they're bad, they, they are, they're going to be a big piece of this as well. Now, will they move the same? Probably not. The big, monstrous market caps that they've got and so forth in the big, big world um, are a lot different, so they're going to move a li little bit differently. But depending on what your risk tolerance is, I think that either way, John, nuclear is here to stay. People are just starting to really get to grips to that whole thing because a lot of people didn't want it. They, didn't, they, didn't want, they don't know enough about it it is still one of the cleanest energies there are. Now, you got to be careful. You got to build these things the right way so that they can function the right way. But the demand for power is going to be there regardless. So with that, you got to take a look at the Camacos and some of the others, maybe URA, whatever it might be. You might want to have at least a little bit of nuclear somewhere in that arsenal when you're looking at energy. Yep, absolutely, Pete. And by the way, folks, um, it ain't just NVIDIA. Pete and I say that all the time. Um, and some people listen, some people pay attention to that, Pete. Yeah. Um, but you look at uh, uh, stocks like Camco, which is CCJ, that's that one that Pete talked about on air with Maria, that one is up huge. I mean, it was a $7 stock, $7.50 in 2020. It's through $50 today. Um, how'd you like to have had a thousand shares of that and ridden that ride? Uh, that's a pretty darn interesting roller coaster, but that ro roller coaster is still going up.